welcome back to Cat's Tutorials. In this video, we're going to be doing practice problem 1.5. Given this current, we are asked to find the power delivered to an element at time equals to 5 milliseconds when this is part A, when the voltage is 2i volt. So we are asked to find, so that's volts, we are asked to find power. So we do know that power is equals to voltage multiplied by current. And so we're given both of these variables, we just basically substitute. So 2i, that's the voltage, and i is given as that. It's given in the question, so it's 5 cos 6t pi t. Now this i is the same i as the one given in the question. So just basically substitute it again. So it's going to be 2 and 5 cos 60 pi t, 5 cos 60 pi t, and it's basically multiplying through. 2 times 5, which is 10, multiplied by 5, get 50. Cause and cause basically have that. This is what we get in terms of C. But we are given a specific time we were supposed to find that power. The specific time is 5 milliseconds. So substituting at time equals to 5 milliseconds, we get what you should make sure is your calculator is in radians and putting that quickly into your calculator should give you 17.27 watts. Moving on to part B of the same question. Part B says the voltage is now 10 plus 5 integral from zero to t over i dt volts. Now using the same formula, p is equal to v multiplied by i. Let's basically substitute what you're given. In place of i, put in the i which is given in question which remains as 5 cos 60 pi t and multiplied again by the same i as in the formula. All of this is a v. Substitute i again. Now let's first solve this part. Then I'm going to multiply everything. So for this part, we have 10, remains the same. And we can take out the 5. So 5 times 5 is just 25. Multiply by the integral of this, which is inside the brackets, which is going to be. So 
from time 0 to time t, multiplied by that. Now it's a matter of multiplying through. multiplied by cos 60 pi t. <coughs> now to find the answer at time is equals to 5 milliseconds. Just basically substitute 5 milliseconds everywhere where you see t. And the final answer should be 29.7 watts.